I just want to, I want to say is I know you're a lot more fashionable than I am, <laughs> but it looks like there was a fire in the middle of the night. I'm a... Uh... <laughs> and you put on whatever was closest. That's exactly what I was going for. <laughs> and uh, I see you've been to the beauty parlor as well. You I know. have. Just you... stress, really. <laughs> before you do something like this, before you dye your hair, which is, you know, a big step to take, do you run it by your wife? Do you, I mean, does, do you check with anyone? A big step to take. Uh, well, for me, I feel like it would be a huge thing to decide to dye my hair. Well, I, I think that the rationale behind, my, yes, but the, I guess the answer, the short answer is my, my wife loves it when I do it. She does. I ran it by her because I want her to want to. I see. So. Right. Of course, but like, why would you do anything? that would, you know, put you in a less than advantageous position when it came to the person that you wanted to want to sleep with you. It doesn't make it's any sense. It's a great question. It's like that you want that from them. It's a smart question. It's a question my wife often asks me. Why would you say something like that right before? See, yeah, that's bad. That's bad. And I you never know. I don't just, know just why. Just say nothing. <laughs> say nothing. I wish that was an option. Just be happy really you're isn't. getting it, man. Just, just sit there and, you know, just... And this is why you've impregnated your wife as well. This is, I know you guys... <laughs> You have Obviously. a 16-month-old daughter. I do. And you I have do. a baby coming soon, right? I mean, Very, very, very soon. Like, yeah. like any minute now. Not, like, not any minute now, but very close. If the baby were to come Thank you. tonight, like, like right now you get a call and you're like, hey, I, I have to go. I got to go to the hospital. Would the band, would the rest of the guys in Maroon 5, would, they, would the show go on? Would they, would they finish the performance tonight no. without you? No, they, they would not. Oh, no, would they, oh, would they do it without me? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> For Nobody obvious reasons. Nobody would jump in and go, hey, this is showbiz, man. We got to make this happen. Well, well, the one reason why that could never happen is because James Valentine would probably be the one to step up and sing. Uh -huh. and he doesn't know any of the words to our songs. <laughs> <laughs> to this day. The songs we've been singing for 20 years, he does not know the answer. OK, of so in other words, if the baby yeah. comes, you're out of here. Guillermo's singing. The show All is right. over. <laughs> How did you do in the delivery room the first time? I assume you were in the delivery room. Uh, yes, I was definitely in the delivery room the whole time. Uh, I got, I received a, a tip from Carson Daly. Okay. You know Carson, <laughs> television's Carson Daly? That's the I guy. I know Carson since he was 12 years old. So the idea that he's, he's giving anyone tips on anything. Well, he has like 400 kids, so. Yeah, he's got a, he's he's got got a, lot a few of children. kids, yeah. yeah. Um, so he said, you have to eat something and remember to eat. Oh. Because you can, they say that like a large percentage of new dads when their wife is in labor, they pass out because they forget to take care of themselves and nourish their bodies with food and then they faint a lot of the time. Oh. I don't know if that's true or not. It sounded pretty official from the way he told me. I, I do know that men do pass out in the delivery room yes. regularly, which is a hell of a way to start as a dad. That's a horrible vibe. <laughs> it's not, it's, 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 it's not, not the first impression you want to yeah, make. Not the pillar of strength she was hoping for. But I think that's um, probably good advice. Was it good advice? Well, it was good advice. But like all good advice, it can be abused, misused. And I, I, what happened was, uh, you know Craig's, the restaurant? Yep. I, I, I ordered a lot of food, because I'm like, I got to eat a lot of stuff now, because <laughs> otherwise I'll faint. <laughs> this is super embarrassing, by the way. And I, I, no, I see myself telling the story and regretting it. Uh, <laughs> but I, I got a lot of food. And, and, and Craig was so sweet. He brought the food to the house. He's like, I'm so excited for you guys. He has twins. And he's like, oh my god, this is going to be great. I'm like, thank you, Craig. Huge bag of food. Cheeseburgers and pizza and just like the comfort food, to, you know, and I just started going at it. What I discovered about myself was that I am a nervous eater. <laughs> and so all throughout, she kind of went into labor throughout the day, you know, and it was very slow and it was beautiful. It was I, I zenned out. I became a different person. You know, I'm not this guy. I actually went a different direction. I was eating a lot though. So, <laughs> so we finally go to the hospital, and I, by the time we get to the hospital, I've put back like an unbelievable amount of food. So I. I, like, a, basically, like, bursting at the seams, like, I'm gonna <laughs> my pants. Like, like, <laughs> like, there's no other way I can tell you this. <laughs> so, but, like, also, my wife is, 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 is in labor. Like, so it's the lamest thing to be when your wife is gonna be having a baby, and you're like, I gotta take a <laughs> little bit. Like, that doesn't, like, yeah. that's not my stomach in hurts. any way a viable complaint. So you gotta, you gotta just keep it inside. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. And so I was yeah. like, man, like, yeah, I'm just gonna wait this out. Cause I could go to the bathroom and come back and like the baby's out and I missed the whole thing. That would be really bad, yeah. So funny. So it as was hell, brutal. Really bad. It was yeah. brutal. So so I, I waited, doubled over uh, in pain, and finally the baby came, it was beautiful and it was amazing. 
And then the second, like, the coast is clear, my wife's good, she's healthy, everyone's happy, I took one of the nurses aside and I was like, look, you gotta find me a bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> and, and she's like, well, there's one right here. And it was like at the foot of my, the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Not this one. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's fatherhood for you. Yeah. You jump right into fatherhood. <laughs> I, I mean, usually it takes guys a little more time to yeah. get there, but yeah. <laughs> you're what they call a natural. If you like that video, click subscribe, and we'll be together until one of us dies.